Hi, my name is Aaron Wolf, and I'd like to share with you today how the guitar as an instrument, or for that matter, any string instrument, really works. You might know patterns like, put your fingers in this pattern, that's a D chord. Or, the strings are called these names, this is low E, this is high E. But low and high are not the way that the guitar really works. This th string we called low E is the closest to the ceiling. What's really happening is we just have different vibration speeds. Thicker, heavier strings go slower, and thin strings go faster. Now I can shorten the strings over here by pushing down, and then the string is touching this metal piece, which is called a fret. And by touching that, it can't move. So the moving part of the string is smaller. So I can speed up the strings by shortening them. I could take this thick string and speed it up until it vibrates the same speed as this thinner string at full length. Over here we have tuners that change the tension of the string. Loosening the tension, looser strings go slower, and tighter strings go faster, up to the point that you might break them, so be careful. So we don't usually use these creatively like this. Usually we just set them in place. We listen carefully until they blend nicely, and there's many different combinations of settings you could use, but mostly we set the tension in place, and then we just use with one hand choosing the length of the string, and the other hand choosing which of the thicker or thinner strings to play. And then we just make combinations of faster and slower vibrations, and that's all there is to most music on the guitar. Have fun! Mm -hmm.